NFL player props here on Prize Picks for Saturday, January 21st. Now, this is for the two games on Saturday divisional round here Kansas City versus Jacksonville and then Philadelphia Eagles versus the New York Giants. Before I get started, there's a link in the description below to sign up for Prize Picks, or you can use promo code TUFF to sign up. Prize Picks will match 100% of your first deposit. There's a Discord link in the description where the main server is completely free. We do also have the Patreon link where I do post all the plays I'm making on Price Picks for each given sport that I do play. Again, I do need to mention as well, I'm not a gambling expert and this is not financial advice. These are simply just the plays I'm personally looking at making, hopefully giving you guys some insight and analysis to make your own player prop decisions. Again, at the end of the video, let me know in the comments below how you guys feel about these props, and please do drop a like on this video as well. But let's get into you guys. Two plays. We got the Jags versus the Chiefs, which has a pretty high over under 52 and a half. Um, Chiefs are obviously nine point favorites, and then we got the Giants Eagles. Um, closer spread here, divisional matchup. This is the third time these teams are going to be playing each other this season. Uh, 48 over under here. Uh, but yeah, let's get into it, you guys. Uh, I do also want to mention really quickly that the there is looking like there's going to be some weather in Kansas City for this game. Um, periods of rain and snow, highs 37 degrees, winds 5 to 10 miles per hour, chance of precipitation 70%. Um, so it's looking like there's going to be some rain slash snow during this game. But the winds estimated at 6 miles per hour, really, really not too strong of winds. So I do not honestly think this is going to impact the game too much here. You can even see here on Roto Grinders, models are coming into better agreement that we'll see at least some pre precipitation here, likely rain or snow mixed during the game time. The precipitation totals remain light, so I think we'll be dealing with some snow showers or light spotty rain. It's not ideal, but with the winds remaining near calm, I don't think it has a significant significant impact on play. So I'm kind of going along with that too. Um, we've seen players just absolutely destroy um, in the air, you know, whether it can be pouring rain and it's not going to really affect too many things offensively the wind is more of a factor obviously but if we get some light rain um i don't think that should be a factor here so let's get into it uh two props technically i guess three three props that i do like um but yeah let's go the first one is going to be trevor lawrence um and patrick mahomes over four and a half pass touchdowns i like this one here you can see here i mean obviously this doesn't have a five game log but if we take a look at a few things, Trevor Lawrence this season, um, I mean, not too many games, seven games here over two total touchdowns or pass touchdowns. He already faced Kansas City, and in that game, um, he had two touchdowns. And if we take a look here at this matchup, exact same matchup in Kansas City, um, Patrick Mahomes, or Trevor Lawrence had two touchdowns, and Patrick Mahomes had four touchdowns. So six total touchdowns between the two of them here. We just need five in this game. I think Patrick Mahomes is good for at least three um, in this matchup against Jacksonville, and I think Trevor Lawrence is going to be playing from behind quite a bit. He's obviously going to be throwing the ball, which should bode well for his chances to give us at least two passing touchdowns. But if we take a look, look here, um, as far as matchups go, the Chiefs give up the most passing touchdowns in the NFL at 33 on the season to Trevor, or Trevor Lawrence is the quarterback this week, but 33 total pass touchdowns to quarterbacks, the most in the NFL, obviously, with their high-scoring offense. Teams do have to throw the ball to stay in the games, which makes sense for there. And then Jaguars, 26 total pass touchdowns on the season, which is good for eighth highest in the NFL. So I think if you take a look at all the quarterbacks in these spots here, I mean, the rest of the quarterbacks here are at the bottom half of the NFL. We got Patrick Mahomes, Trevor Lawrence in a great spot here to throw pass touchdowns combined. I think five touchdowns between the two of them. Strong play in my opinion. I think obviously with the over-under being extremely high as well. I think this has good odds here. Um, taking a look at another one here in this game. It's a first half prop and I'm going with uh, our guy Patty Mahomes. I like his over 12 and a half fantasy score in the first half. Um, he set this over five of his last five games. 12.6, 14.16, 13 and a half, 15.76 and 15.9. Uh, fantasy points we can see here like i said patrick mahomes faced kansas city earlier or faced jaguars earlier this season he threw three pass touchdowns in the first half pass td to tony pass td to scantling pass td to td, TD to oa gray all in the first half here we don't even need three pass touchdowns for patrick mahomes to hit the over on this it's a great spot um we can see here just fantasy points to the quarterback position on this on the season jaguars um, what is this? One to eighth most fantasy points to the quarterback position, 21.8. Great spot here for Patrick Mahomes, I think, in the first half. Obviously, it's just been kind of a wagon play here. I mean, his pass there is set at 162. So I'm taking fantasy score at 12.5 here for him um, in this game. So these are the first two plays here, obviously, from Jacksonville, Kansas City. I did want to take a break really quick and talk about Thrive Fantasy really quickly, you guys. There's currently a Thrive Fantasy promo going on. Saquon Barkley over. 0.5 rushing yards so will he have one rushing yard here free square 
for new years is only on thrive fantasy again if you guys are not yet signed up for thrive there's a link in the description below to sign up for thrive fantasy they do have they will match 100 of your first deposit and they do have the highest multipliers in the industry two out of two picks correctly when you 3.2x three of three when you 5.2x four of four when you 10.2x and then five of five when 20.2x your entry amount you can see here they got the, the props here for this weekend on the board already on thrive fantasy again 100 percent deposit match we got the free square for new year's is right now sick on barkley will he have over one rushing yard go ahead and check out thrive fantasy you guys highest multipliers in the game been having a lot of fun over there go ahead and check out that link in the description below but let's get back to the price picks plays so we're taking a look here at these two so far the third one is going to be a pass yards prop in the first half again we're going with our wagon jalen hurts over 124 and a half pass yards in the first half he's hit the over on this in his last five games here and you can see here twice against the new york giants has already cleared the over on this 171 and 140 pass yards here against the giants in the last four, like four games five games he's played i mean gardner Minshew played right so i mean these obviously these dates don't line up for like the last five games but 171 and 140 already this season against the new york giants at home divisional playoff game i think the new, uh, philadelphia eagles offense comes out really honestly ready to play if we take a look at the odds here we got jalen hurts i mean 244 and a half caesars has his minus 117 244 and a half for his full game bet mgm has this at 246 and a half so again first half props here obviously have some value with just the game script being pretty normal i mean the game script can't really be too affected in the first half um jalen hurts again like i said has done this twice already against um the new york giants love this play here a lot over 124 and a half first half pass yards for jalen hurts so these are the three plays here i'm targeting obviously i'm targeting um more here i think there's some interesting ones especially in this first half i mean this noah gray one at 0.5 i just wanted to share a few of these with you guys these aren't official plays or anything but this noah gray one here over 0.5 fantasy score in the first half super interesting all he needs is one catch to the over on this one and he's pretty much had one catch in his last five games here um there's some other ones down here i think daniel jones at eight a little bit too low coming off a game where he had you know, three straight three straight games on the over on this one um 16 16 and 12 this one is extremely interesting here as well at eight fantasy score um and then jalen hurts 12 and a half fantasy score is a strong one as well and looking at full game um i do also i'm just you know trying to give you guys some value here i do like um Christian Kirk at five and a half. I think it's interesting. They're going to have to throw the ball. Devonta Smith at five. Super interesting to me. I mean, he's pushed her better in his last five here. And we, he's already had seven receptions. I think five receptions here against the New York Giants already. So definitely a ton of value on the board currently, you guys, for these for this Saturday, January 21st, late Jacksonville, Chiefs, Eagles, Philly, or Eagles, New York Giants. Let me know in the comments below you guys feel about these props. Again, prize picks link to sign up. Description below. Patreon link, Discord link thrive fantasy link is in the description below of this video as well with the free sake on square drop a like on this video you guys hit that subscribe button and as always let's cash